we took a trip to the seaside. Blackpool, the home of ballroom. It's so good to be home. Right now, being in this ballroom, it exceeds my expectations. It's even more beautiful than I thought it was going to be. The atmosphere is incredible. I told you, didn't I? You certainly did. <laughs> When we first got on the floor and it was bouncing, I was like, what is this? But it actually helps us, I think. It helps time. you a little bit. <laughs> We've got three guys underneath the sheet. They're holding me Lifting up. Lauren. And then she drops into the river. One of them didn't go I, so I well. I sat on it and I was like, oh, this is fun. Yeah, it's pretty risky, but it's worth it. What will Anton think? It's During the week, it. that's what he, he says. He loves it. What would Anton think? You look yeah. like a proper dancer. Good. Oh. Good is that we're in Blackpool, so you're going to come in, you're going to come in flying on a stick of rock, right? It's just incredible. I'm just so lucky to be here. It's wicked. Hello, it takes two. Come and join me in my Blackpool Winnebago. Meet the parents on the way. So in the kitchen, we have some chicken and some fish and chips. Coming to Blackpool is always like coming home because obviously my first time here at Blackpool was when I was seven. It's just the most magnificent place in the world. Okay, I've got chicken to eat, so I have to chase you boys out, 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 out. I am Gloria Stefan and I can't wait to see everybody get on their feet. We've got a show coming in June, so I wanted to remind the UK fans of, you know, what they're gonna get. We all grew up dancing to her songs. It's such a privilege to be sharing a stage with her. It's such a big dance, isn't it? Like, you can close your eyes and you can feel it. It's quite literally from the floor. Yeah. Quite interesting seeing our professionals dance like that. I feel sorry for them having to it's dance brilliant. with us. We have Karen and Ricardo, who are amazing salsa dancers. The tricks, the spins are absolutely incredible. That opening number, truly phenomenal. She should be very proud of himself. I was blown away. It's my birthday weekend. Ali Ash came out onto the floor with a cake, and all of a sudden, behind all the dancers came Gloria Estefan. She's one of my favorite, favorite artists in the history of music. Dreams come true on Strictly Come Dancing. One more caffeine hit, and we're off. I love it. I feel properly like the part today. Well, good luck, everybody. Have a fab show. Thank you. Thank you. Counting us on air. Five, four, three, two, one. Please give an enormous black hole welcome to our Strictly Fab. Talk about Faye and Giovanni setting the dance floor alight with the Paso Doble. Darcy said that Faye was dramatic, yet still feminine. Loved her flip straight lift as well. Uh, were you impressed by how she controlled it and then got back straight into the dance? Oh, that flip lift was sensational. Yeah. Um, the trick is here to stay focused, tall, tighten your butt cheeks and let oh. the boys do the rest. Right. And there comes Giovanni and just to drag her off to somewhere else. <laughs> and the right is in a little bit more aggression. Think of a dragon and then that smoke comes oh, at the nose oh just gosh. like that. I want to do that now, but I'm worried what else might come out of my mouth. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little runny nose, you know. <laughs> a dragon in the nose. I like that. Okay, Graham and Oti, theatre and jazz style. It's our dance of survivors, of course. Shirley said he did not miss. It's here for a much needed warm up. <laughs> Wand in mouth. Uh, they're still smouldering after their fiery Paso. Faye and Giovanni are here. Yeah. And it's time to turn up the heat as we launch our 2018 Pro Challenge. Exciting times. Who cares about the Glitter Ball Trophy when pride and a world record are at stake? But first, 
Blackpool, but a distant to them. Faye and Chavani have the waltz after a very dramatic, very oh. good pas de doble last yes. week. I think we're all agree. Um, yes. Elegant and graceful this dance must be. How yes. is Faye handling the change? Definitely. I think, Renu, she's had like one like very dramatic dance and then a, a, a lovely soft yeah, dance week after week. Yeah, the whole way through the series. So, yeah. Um, yeah, this is looking lovely, as you can see. <laughs> and um, gorgeous. Obviously, I'm saying that because Giovanni's here. <laughs> um, <laughs> and, and she's always in a lovely position. Yes, yeah, very yes. much, Faye. You're always in a lovely position. <laughs> but what I did notice here, um, be careful, Faye, because sometimes when you're stepping forward in your on your ones, you turn your foot out a little bit too much. So you don't get your lovely, <laughs> lovely heel leads okay. in there. Oh, that's, that's only so some of them. It's only some of them, but because you've got a lovely turnout, it's <laughs> difficult. <laughs> Savani's coming to get you in a minute. Yeah. Um, <laughs> Stacey and Kevin are doing the Paso Doble this week. Uh, she was fantastic opening the show last week. Now, Darcy says she can get a bit... Pasha Corvalo, clever, clever man, clever, clever man. Uh, my final guest turned up the heat with an epic Paso that set the tower ballroom dance floor alight, quite literally. Faye and Giovanni will be here right after this. Beautiful, strong delivery, dramatic attack. This girl was the puzzle dominatrix. <laughs> Throw anything at me, I can handle it. Drama, theatre, story, aggression, tension, brilliant. Wow, welcome Ray and Giovanni. I'd love to know how many times you watch that back. You guys <laughs> now have the highest scoring Paso Doble of the series so far. Yeah, Giovanni, yeah. your highest scoring Paso ever. Amazing. Well, that is so, I know, look, just so happy, so happy. How does it feel? How, that's you out there, FA. Wow, it was just such an incredible night. And Blackpool yeah. definitely feels bigger and better than being in the studio. Um, it was just great to have the crowds and the extra dancers and yeah. the fire and the music. And it was lovely. <laughs> <laughs> also, I think just seeing that side of you. Uh, a few weeks ago, you asked yourself the question, who is Faye Toza? Um, did you ever think that Paso Dominatrix would be the answer to that question? <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you to Bruno Tonioli yeah. for that one. Um, it was actually, it was like almost like a bit of a release being able to like go out there and be yeah. a bit angry and a bit feisty. There's quite a lot of the build up to um, Blackpool and it was the perfect uh, routine uh, for that, yeah. Um, I have to say, did uh, Faye's always so smiley and so gorgeous with everybody. Did you know? Did she surprise you when that side of her came out? I oh, mean, definitely. Yeah. Everything started when the music started, and everything. I said to Faye, "We need to bring the fire on, the, on the, in black because it, pas doble is really important. Sometimes you start to smile it a bit, then the <laughs> pas doble is gone. Yeah. So when the music starts, she was like looking at me all the way, and I was like, "Yes, that's my girl. Well done. That's well done. your girl. Well done. Good, well good done. training. Did it shock?" your parents to see that side to you. Dorothy and Angus having a Aww. lovely time in the audience there. Mom what did they make of it? Um, <laughs> they grew up with me. They know I've got that side to <laughs> I me. Know, of course they do. not come out usually. <laughs> um, I think mum and dad were really proud actually. I saw them just afterwards and they had a little tear in their eye. I think they're just dead proud. They must be yeah. so proud, so they should be. You were really going for it out there. We've actually got a recording of your microphone. Oh, no. Have a listen at this. <laughs> this is so, so good. <laughs> as you yes. went down to the floor there. What, what were you thinking there to bring out that fire and that fury, Faye? Do you know, it's been um, quite, quite a long sort of nine weeks, ten <laughs> weeks <laughs> so Tell me far. about it. <laughs> I'm not even dancing. <laughs> I don't know. I think it was all of that just going, yeah. ah, yeah. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, good yeah. release, though. Yeah. Um, <laughs> did you stay in character all weekend? I was going to say that could have made for an interesting black ball. Um, no, 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 no. no. Um, Do you have fun at the party, though? Well, I, I, got, I finished the dance and I was like, like yeah, we did really well. <laughs> we had a lovely back, time. Back to Faye. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, of course, you were the cape. You had to deal with a lot of balls. Three, to be exact. Yeah. And then you did this move. Here you go. The incredible. Look at that flip. This is it in slow motion. Ooh. Beautiful. Giovanni, is that difficult to do? You oh, have is good abs. Super for that. difficult. You have to trust people doing for this. Yeah. You know? It's just you let it go. I said to her, look, they're gonna never gonna drop you. 
just them, let them to do what they have to do and just stay strong. And he did it. Yeah, well done. you have to put your trust in them. But I quite like fun fair rides. <laughs> so oh, do you like roller coasters? Yeah, oh, brilliant. Like that. Yeah, well, let's do well, it. Off you go. Yeah. <laughs> I love, love what we're learning about you, Fatoza. <laughs> um, so this week, it, it's all change for you. Like him saying, oh, you go like, yeah. oh, to a waltz. Yeah. Beautiful waltz, passo frown, upside down, and you are dancing waltz to DC Lee. Let's have a listen again. <laughs> And he's singing again. <laughs> How we've missed that. It's very high for you, Giovanni. Yeah. Um, is he letting you smile this week with a waltz? Well, well it's we'll kind of like it's a beautiful waltz, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, we were supposed to do another dance. You know, on Monday we were supposed to do the American Smooth Venus Waltz. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But after, you know, we finished the routine and everything, and uh, we tried some lift. And I got injured a little bit in my back, <gasps> so we You're changed the routine injured. yesterday. Oh broke no! Him. So yeah, no, You've it's not broken. broken him. It's just it j you know, we just well decided to go <laughs> with the waltz. Okay, so safer with the waltz. Safer with the, the waltz. Lifts. Yes. Okay. But I'm again, it's going yeah. it's going really well. You know, it's Borum again. We are back in Borum. I think she's brilliant in Borum. So I'm really I'm really looking forward to for Southern. Remember those yeah. heel leads though, right? Ian. Get those yes. heel Ian leads. just say that. <laughs> okay, and I must very quickly ask you about the Lindy Hopathon yeah. as well. How's that going? Wow, fast. it's really fast. <laughs> <laughs> it's really fun because it's all a bit manic and it's not technique, technique. And I think it's going to be so fun to get on the floor and just like, let <laughs> it go. Yeah. Please incorporate yeah. that move that Ian did earlier yeah, on. Yeah, I think it's good. a winner. Yeah. Uh, good luck. You're tremendous. Bye, and Giovanni, everyone. Thank you. Thank you. That's all we have time for on tonight's show. Join me tomorrow at 6.30 when I'll be chatting to those dancing fools, Joe and Diane, and finding out if they can turn three tens into four with their couple's choice. The pro challenge continues with Neil Jones, plus Vicky Gill is here with some more glamorous garments for you all to see. We'll see you tomorrow night. Thanks for watching. Good night. <laughs>night night in Blackpool we are back in our spiritual home here at Elstree and do you know what the atmosphere has changed the finals in sight and things are getting tense Faye and Giovanni are putting the final touches on their waltz and it's beautiful Seven couples left in the competition. I'll be trying to catch up with as many as I can throughout this show. Birthday kisses, Zoe. <laughs> but once it clicks, I think it'll be a lot of fun. When I found out we were doing the waltz, I was actually really excited. What is really important is the swing and the shape of the body. Free. Free. But it's tricky. It's free. Once I get one part right, mm -mm. then another bit will go. And two. No. So my job is to make sure I'm maintaining the frame, letting him lead me, which I sometimes don't find easy. One, two, back to me. of concentration. We have so much to discuss. Dan, let's talk about Faye and mm, Giovanni. Yes. They have a waltz this week uh, to DC Lee. Here they are in training. Are you liking what you see? Well, she is magnificent. They're, they're a great partnership, aren't they? But I think she might suffer from the fact that, a bit like Ashley, she was too good too early in okay. the competition. Yeah. And everybody watching Strictly loves those who don't start off brilliant mm -hmm. and get better and better. I think Faye was that good at the start. Where do you go with her? No journey, Dan, no journey. No, no, you need a journey, you need no a journey. No you need a journey. The ladies uh, in the yeah. audience are disagreeing there. No, they're kind she of, oh no, some are agreeing. <laughs> yes, okay, a mixed opinion. Lorraine, uh, they've been very consistent with their scores, but they've only topped the leaderboard once this series. I was really surprised by this. Um, second uh, for six out of the nine weeks. So can they get back on top? What do they need to do to be back in pole position? Um, I think she needs more character. I mm -hmm. think um, she's quite stern and she can do that, but maybe s relax, add a bit more character to it. Okay, maybe. that's not the easiest thing to do it's with the waltz, is that? No, sure. no, yeah, a bit of freedom. <laughs> yeah, out She's of She's amazing, though. Okay, she is but amazing. she is incredible. Yeah. And I mean, we are nitpicking, of exactly, course, because exactly. they're so good. So Robbie, sure. Ash yeah. and Pash, they got the first 40 last weekend. How do they follow that? with? I love the dancing, and you get to hang out with the most amazing people. It's 
It's one of the best things I've ever done. I don't think you can ever get used to your nerves or the feeling of performing on a Saturday night. My experience on Strictly has just been incredible. I've changed a lot of people's opinions on myself. I've proved to a lot of people that I can